Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Emmanuel here. And uh, today I'll be looking at seven best blogging platforms for your affiliate marketing. If you're going to succeed in affiliate marketing, blogging is at the heart of it because you are going to offer value to your customers through your blog. Uh, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing so that you don't miss any of our video whenever we release it. Let's dive in into today's topic. Seven best blogging platform for your affiliate marketing. Number one is WordPress. WordPress is a content management system that will help you to create any type of blog. And the beauty of it is that WordPress is free. You're not going to pay any money for WordPress. There are two ways to go about it. You're either using WordPress um, hosted by WordPress or you're doing self-hosted. I advise that you use self-hosted so that you can have your domain name to yourself but it will cost you a little because you're going to buy a domain name and hosting. But if you don't have any money here, you can still start by going to wordpress.com and creating an account, all right? You create an account and you have your domain name but it's going to be your domain name uh, slash wordpress.com but of course, you can always move from um, WordPress hosted to yourself hosted. All right, number two is Wix. Wix is also a content management system that is basically designed for subscription. So they have a drag and drop uh, system whereby you can create an account on their platform and they have all the templates for you. All you need to do is just subscribe and you start creating your website. They have various templates that can create any type of website. Number three is Blogger. Blogger is owned by Google. They didn't create it, but actually bought it from the creator. And now, many people who started blogging actually started with Blogger because Blogger is totally free. But of course, like I always say, it's better that you are totally in charge because on Blogger, Google is in charge and they can knock you out anytime. So, but you can start there for free. That's a good thing. You can start for free. And of course, as you grow, you can always move to your own self-hosted platform. So, you can begin with Blogger today. Just go to blogger.com and register and begin creating your blog. Number three is Squarespace. Squarespace is also a content management system, but it's subscription. It's not totally free. You're going to subscribe to be able to use their platform. But the good thing is that they have everything you need already on the platform. So you simply create an account and you begin creating your website. But of course, you're going to be paying monthly. So kind of a bit uh, expensive, all right? Number four is, is it number four now? Okay, number four or number five is Medium. All right, Medium is also a blogging platform. The beauty about Medium is that Medium is totally free, all right? Medium is kind of, uh, um, I think it's a place for new bloggers to start. It kind of looks like LinkedIn, you understand? LinkedIn, before when they started early, they were into a lot of articles. So people who come there and create a lot of articles, but today they've evolved into something else. But on Medium, you're basically telling your story yourself and the platform allows you to tell it anyhow you wish. Of course, you can write loads of articles. The good thing is that Medium already has a lot of traffic. So that means if you create a blog on Medium, you're going to get access to a lot of traffic because people go there to read all manner of articles. So if you create uh, your own blog on Medium, you also have access opportunity to be able to add your link as your affiliate link on what you have created on Medium. But of course, you have your community guideline so that you don't overdo it. If you overdo it, they will knock you out. You know, that's the disadvantage of creating on a third party platform. So hop on to Medium and create your website today. Number six, I guess, is Weebly. Weebly is another content management system, a platform where you can create a blog. It's also uh, a subscription-based platform, meaning that you have to pay monthly to be able to use the platform. But the good thing is that they have all the templates. Everything you need is on the platform. So once you sign up and you pay, you'll be able to use the platform. And finally, number seven is Ghost. For Ghost, the good thing about Ghost is that you can you know, start for free for 14 days. They have a 14 days free trial for you to test out things and see if it's something you can use. But the other side of it is that after 14 days, you start paying. And of course, personally, I don't like subscription. Anything that has to do with subscription, well, because you have to pay every month. And for a blogger, somebody who is looking to make money, if you have to pay every month, is normally very, very burdensome. So you ask me what's my take on all this. 
I will say um, start with Medium, right? Because Medium is totally free. Or you start with Blogger. These platforms are free. You can get started creating your blog, creating your content, and of course, you can also pull in traffic. The difference between Medium and Blogger is that Medium is a platform that houses a lot of content, right? And the whole content is open to everybody. In fact, they even help you, you know, push your content out because they send notification to people who are subscribed to their platforms and all that. So you can actually get tons of traffic from Medium. But on Blogger, you're basically doing your thing. That this is free, you can start creating immediately. So if you ask me where to start, I would say start with Medium or start with Blogger or start with both of them. <laughs> yes, in conclusion, I will run through the list again. I said number one is WordPress, and number two is Wix, number three, Blogger, number four, Squarespace, number five, Medium, number six, Weekly, and number seven is Good. And I said the best place to begin is begin with Medium if you don't have any money. But if you have some little dollar to spend, maybe like $100 or less, you can go ahead and go to WordPress Street buy your domain name, uh, buy your hosting. You can use Namecheap to buy your domain name and hosting and you start creating your blog. Of course, if you check the channel on that website, there's a lot of loads of videos I've done on how to get started with WordPress using Namecheap. So you can buy your domain, buy your hosting, and I've done a video, everything from scratch. It's very simple, straightforward. If you watch those videos, you're going to see how to get started. Of course, I'm also going to leave links to Namecheap so that in case you want to buy your domain and host it, you can hop in and start uh, creating. The best thing is to get started, right? Whether you have money or not, there's a platform for you to get started. Of course, you can always grow, you can always scale. So get going and get doing something. And I'll see you again in another video.